One of Sheikh Hamdan's recent love poems is next on my list, and I want to share it with you. He shared this particular poem on August 1st, 2023. Sheikh Hamdan has written many poems, but this is his latest. It was posted on the day he traveled back to England. He still can't forget past events that hold deep meaning for him. In the poem, Sheikh Hamdan reflects on memories associated with a special time in his life, reminiscing about a love that was once bright and joyful. His loved one had lived with him in his palace but had previously lived elsewhere. Their separation on August the 1st still deeply affects him, and the poem expresses his sorrow. The poem translates his feelings into a metaphor of a sunset, representing past experiences and deep emotions. The lines suggest that sunsets bring back memories, not just for their beauty, but for the emotions they evoke. He speaks to those who have felt deep love and loss, indicating that physical distance, not the sunset itself, caused the separation. The poem mentions how recalling the sunset brings nostalgia, a longing for the past mixed with both happiness and sadness. Sheikh Hamdan shares his pain through a prayer for all lovers to find peace. He talks about secrets held in the hearts of those who love deeply and the challenges they face. He concludes by addressing men who cherish their partners, highlighting that the real issues in relationships come from the space between people, not from the love itself. The poem subtly discusses his own experiences with love and separation, hinting at a painful secret that influenced his personal decisions. This poem, shared with the world on August 1st, 2023, captures Sheikh Hamdan's enduring feelings and the complexities of his personal experiences. I hope you find meaning and emotion in every word of his poem. This is Sheikh Hamdan, the Crown Prince of Dubai, and this is his ex-wife, Haya bint al Hussein. Today we'll be figuring out if Sheikh Hamdan, or also known as Faza, still loves his ex-wife by analyzing poems shared by him and the emotions conveyed in them. Recently, Sheikh Hamdan has been sharing his poetic expressions on social media, which have caught the attention of many people. These poems are believed to be dedicated to his ex-wife, Haya bint al Hussein, whom he divorced in 2019. Sheikh Hamdan is known for his love for poetry and literature. The poems shared by Sheikh Hamdan are heartfelt and emotional, and they have caught the attention of many people. In these poems, Sheikh Hamdan expresses his love and admiration for his ex-wife, and he also reflects on the memories they shared together. The emotions conveyed in these poems are deep and intense, and they have resonated with many viewers. Some viewers have even expressed their own emotions and experiences in the comments section of Sheikh Hamdan's social media posts. The impact of these poems on the viewers has been significant, as they have sparked discussions and debates about love, relationships, and the power of poetry. Many people have been inspired by Sheikh Hamdan's poetic expressions and have started to explore their own emotions through writing and sharing their own poetry. Sheikh Hamdan's relationship with his ex-wife, Haya bint al Hussein has been the subject of much speculation and discussion. The couple got married in 2004 and had two children together before getting divorced in 2019. Since their divorce, Sheikh Hamdan has been sharing heartfelt poems on social media, which many people believe are dedicated to his ex-wife. These poems express Sheikh Hamdan's love and admiration for Haya, and they reflect on the memories they shared together. Despite their divorce, it is clear that Sheikh Hamdan still has strong feelings for his ex-wife. The emotions conveyed in his poems are deep and intense, and they suggest that he is still struggling to come to terms with the end of their relationship. The impact of Sheikh Hamdan's poems on his ex-wife is unclear, as she has not made any public statements about them. However, it is likely that she is aware of them and has been affected by them in some way. Sheikh Hamdan's relationship with his ex-wife is complex and emotional, and it is clear that he still has strong feelings for her. The poems he has shared on social media have sparked discussions and debates about love, relationships, and the power of poetry, and they have touted the hearts of many people. We hope that this section has provided you with a better understanding of Sheikh Hamdan's relationship with his ex-wife and the impact of his poems on their relationship.
Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, also known as Faza, is the Crown Prince of Dubai and the second eldest son of the current ruler of Dubai, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum. Sheikh Hamdan was born on November 14th, 1982, and he has been involved in various aspects of Dubai's government and society since a young age. He is known for his love of sports, poetry, and adventure, and he has a strong social media presence with millions of followers on various platforms. Sheikh Hamdan is also a successful businessman and investor with interests in various industries, including real estate, technology, and finance. He is the chairman of the Dubai Executive Council and the Dubai Sports Council, and he has played a key role in the development of Dubai's economy and infrastructure. Despite his busy schedule, Sheikh Hamdan is known for his philanthropic work and his commitment to social causes. He has launched various initiatives to support education, health care, and environmental conservation and he has been recognized for his contributions to society by various organizations and institutions. Sheikh Hamdan's life is characterized by his diverse interests, his commitment to public service, and his love for his country and its people. He is a prominent figure in Dubai's society and a role model for many people around the world. We hope that this section has provided you with a better understanding of Sheikh Hamdan's life and his contributions to society. In conclusion, Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Crown Prince of Dubai, is a prominent figure in Dubai's society and a role model for many people around the world. He is known for his diverse interests, his commitment to public service, and his love for his country and its people. It is important to note that Sheikh Hamdan's personal life is his own, and he has the right to privacy and respect. As such, it is important to approach discussions about his personal life with sensitivity, and respect for his privacy. Overall, Sheikh Hamdan's life and contributions to society are a testament to his dedication and commitment to making the world a better place. We hope that this summary has provided you with a better understanding of Sheikh Hamdan's life and the recent discussions surrounding his relationship with his ex-wife. This is Sheikh Hamdan, Dubai's crown prince and the Dubai's ruler son. But even though all the fame and luxury, did you know that Sheikh Hamdan's life is full of secrets and heartbreak? We'll reveal the untold story of his wife and a poem that he shared a few months ago. Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Crown Prince of Dubai, is married to Sheikha Sheikha bint Said bin Thani Al Maktoum. Sheikha Sheikha is the daughter of Said bin Thani Al Maktoum a member of Dubai's ruling family. The couple got married in a private ceremony in 2019, and their wedding was attended by close family members and friends. Sheikha Sheikha is known for her love of horses and equestrian sports, and she has participated in several competitions in the UAE and abroad. She is also involved in various charitable initiatives and has supported causes related to education, health care, and animal welfare. However, their marriage has been the subject of rumors and controversies. Some reports suggest that Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha have faced challenges in their relationship, including differences in personality and lifestyle. There have also been rumors of infidelity and marital discord, although these claims have not been confirmed by either party. Despite these challenges, Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha have remained married and continue to support each other in their personal and professional endeavors. The Crown Prince of Dubai has faced personal struggles throughout his life. In a poem that he shared on August 1st, 2023, Sheikh Hamdan revealed some of the challenges he has faced, including feelings of loneliness, sadness, and despair. He also spoke about the pressure he feels as a leader and the weight of responsibility that comes with his position. Despite his privileged upbringing and position of power, Sheikh Hamdan's struggles highlight the fact that mental health issues can affect anyone, regardless of their background or status. His openness about his struggles has been praised by many, as it helps to break down the stigma surrounding mental health and encourages others to seek help when they need it. In addition to his personal struggles, Sheikh Hamdan has also faced criticism and controversy in his public life. He has been accused of animal cruelty, 
for his involvement in horse racing and equestrian sports, and there have been concerns about the welfare of the animals under his care. He has also faced criticism for his lavish lifestyle and spending habits, which some see as out of touch with the needs of the wider population. Despite these challenges, Sheikh Hamdan remains a respected leader and a symbol of hope for many in Dubai and beyond. His willingness to speak openly about his struggles and his commitment to philanthropy and social causes have earned him the admiration of many, and he continues to work towards a better future for his country and its people. In conclusion, Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Crown Prince of Dubai, is a complex figure who has faced both personal struggles and public controversies. Despite these challenges, he remains a respected leader and a symbol of hope for many in Dubai and beyond. Sheikh Hamdan's openness about his mental health struggles has been praised by many as it helps to break down the stigma surrounding mental health and encourages others to seek help when they need it. His commitment to philanthropy and social causes has also earned him the admiration of many as he works towards a better future for his country and its people. However, Sheikh Hamdan has also faced criticism and controversy in his public life. His involvement in horse racing and equestrian sports has led to accusations of animal cruelty and his lavish lifestyle and spending habits have been seen by some as out of touch with the needs of the wider population. Are you curious to know if Sheikh Hamdan is now a single father? In this video, we'll reveal the latest information about his personal life and answer this burning question. But that's not all. We'll also take a look at his wife, the Princess of Dubai, and explore their relationship. Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, also known as Faza, is the Crown Prince of Dubai and the second eldest son of the current ruler of Dubai, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum. Sheikh Hamdan is known for his love for animals, poetry, and adventurous spirit. He is also known for his close relationship with his family, including his wife, Sheikha Sheikha bint Said bin Thani Al Maktoum. Sheikha Sheikha is the daughter of Said bin Thani Al Maktoum, a member of Dubai's ruling family. She and Sheikh Hamdan got married in a private ceremony in 2019, which was attended by close family members and friends. The couple's wedding was not publicly announced, but pictures of the ceremony were later shared on social media. Sheikha. Sheikha is known for her love for horses and equestrian sports. She has participated in several horse riding competitions and has won several awards. She's also known for her philanthropic work and has supported several charitable organizations in the UAE. Despite their private nature, uh, Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha have been spotted together in public on several occasions. They have also been seen attending events and functions together. However, rumors of a potential divorce between the couple have been circulating in the media. The reasons for the rumors are unclear, and neither Sheikh Hamdan nor Sheikha Sheikha have publicly commented on them. Recent news and rumors have been circulating about Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum and his wife Sheikha Sheikha bint Said bin Thani Al Maktoum. The rumors suggest that the couple may be getting a divorce, which has caused speculation about the future of Sheikh Hamdan's role as Dubai's crown prince. The rumors started circulating in early 2022 when Sheikha Sheikha was noticeably absent from public events and social media posts. This led to speculation that the couple may have separated or were going through a rough patch in their marriage. However, neither Sheikh Hamdan nor Sheikha Sheikha have publicly commented on the rumors. The rumors gained more traction in the media when Sheikh Hamdan was seen attending public events alone without his wife. This led to further speculation that the couple may have separated or were in the process of getting a divorce. However, there has been no official confirmation of these rumors. The potential divorce of Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha has caused concern among some members of the public who worry about the impact it may have on Dubai's ruling family and the country's future. However, it is important to note that these rumors are unconfirmed and it is unclear whether there is any truth to them.
In conclusion, recent news and rumors suggest that Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikh Sheikha may be getting a divorce, but there has been no official confirmation of these rumors. The potential divorce has caused concern among some members of the public, but it is important to wait for official confirmation before jumping to conclusions. In this video, we will see Sheikh Hamdan poetry. Enjoy. Accept the love's feeling from the one who is passionate about you, you gentle person with soft skin. If you want me to reply to you to what you told me, I will tell you a secret and I will forgive you if you write it down for others to see. Longing in Dubai is just like longing in London. It has that passion which fills people's hearts. Learn and stay open-minded and civilized, but know when to respond. To put an end to an emotional question, I will tell you something that will give you the answer to your love. Longing in the sixth month. June is different from longing in the seventh and the ninth and the ten, between you and me. The bird of love is surrounding you like a snare, you who hide feelings inside you and on the longest ribs of the chest of the one who weeps and wants you the heart is full and will be cunning. If you deny that your sensitive heart is anxiously longing for me and ask the heart, your heart will say, don't deny it. Thank you for the smile that you gave me that burns in the deep hollow of my body, heart. As for the abandonment and rejection, I am not thankful to you for that. The daughters of Adam and Eve from Anud al-Nuf, deer's eyes from the highest clouds on a mountain, and the one who showed her beauty is intoxicating compared to what she possess from descriptions. Compare it to what you have between you and me. Frankly, there is something between us that is not comparable. You bring me an expression that calls for good and give me an eye that forbids me from evil, al -Shuf. Look, and if I ask you, you say that love is conspiring, cunning. Hit and run is not familiar for a shiki, your lover. And how can you be good at fleeing or fighting, evading, escaping? Faza, the dear poem, thanks to God for you, who are considered the symbol of beauty in Dubai. You are not ordinary. Some people said you look like a deer, and others said your ways are that of a deer, the way you stand, the way you move, and the way you behave. After hearing their opinions, I wanted to give you my own explanation. Either your father was a deer, and you got your beautiful traits from him, or your father was indiscreet with a deer in his foolishness of youth. Whichever the case is, how lucky is the man who tempted and attracted you to be in contact with him. Impression. Inside ourselves, we don't know our purpose. The absence of our beloveds leave an impression in our hearts. Life's madness makes us sometimes wish that we had a soul without a body. The one who awaits raindrops from the clouds is affected by his emotions and feelings. The view itself makes the one who looks at her smile. God has given her everything beautiful. If you wanted to draw her lips, you would need a professional painter or take a drawing class yourself. Her full bosom is reflected in her mirror, but her waist is slim. If I mentioned her name, it would increase the passion, but my love is enough without saying her name. She is more beautiful than life and its pleasures. Do I need to swear by it or is enough? The cooing of doves. Hey, you with your sleepy eyes and you don't say a word. Maybe the curtain of absence went down. My heart obeys you more than a ring on a finger. A flock of doves carry my longing for your gratification. It moves through my veins. The sound of the doves cooing melts my heart. People who dress in expensive clothes and business suits still talk to me. God blessed you with a nice body, with some parts moderate, some extreme, and I was blessed with the skill to write a poem that the nation of the prophet will argue about. You close the door to communication. You stubborn and abundant. You thought I would stop thinking about you, but instead my longing increased. Maybe you forgot to lock the door. Oh, my friend, celebrate every Eid with me. Long live love, loyalty, and justice. Start howling like the wolf until I understand what you really want from me. And suddenly, yes, yes, I started to look like the ghost of love, only for you. Yes, you, you.
who made me crazy because of your lovely way in love. You just have to choose what you want me to be, and I will be it for you. Do you want me to be like the wolf or to be like the ghost of love? Even if I didn't do anything wrong to you, but it's okay. It's my fault, and I'm sorry for it. If I just, just try to imagine my life without you, my tears drop down from my eyes without any control from me, I'm fine, and my health is good. But what about you? Please tell me, are you okay? Is your health good? By the way, I miss you. Photo posted by Faza on 9th if June 2019. Special hey who owns an awesome eye looks amazing like the deer's beautiful eyes. Your sniper lost his mind from your eyes beauty. You are the most expensive thing at my life and I love you so much. And be sure as much the green branch hold the air I'm holding you and save you inside me. There is no way to let you go away from me. I'm for you and you always will be just for me. Inside our heads there is our love. No one can break our love. You are a very interesting person for me. You are very important for me. You own an expensive value inside me. And for who want us to leave our love, they are very cheap people and no one can let me go away from you. Especially for your eyes, I will leave all of them and be only for you because I love you. You own a big place inside me and you know how much I love you and you also are sure from that do you know what about my heart, which is inside my chest? There is only you who dwell on it, and there is a line which is full, with all truth and honest. Focus on it, please. You have to remember that, even if the time's face looks so pale, I want you to trust in our love and never lose your faith in love. If you just try to go away from me, that case looks like the bomb, which can kill three people. Your best friend and beloved's absence can make more than bombs killing effect. Hey, you always be with me. Enlighten my heart. You are illuminating my life with your beautiful appearance, enlightening the depth of the heart. With your appearance, I am not able to say except, oh, beautiful. May your day be delighted. Your happiness is the motivation and my honesty is your motivation. From the light of your face, May your evening be beautiful, and the one who sees you says, Our sun is hidden from the radiation of your appearance. Arabic poem by Faza, longing with no ending. Oh, the first beginning of the actualization of her as a lover, passionately, destiny supports me with you since the beginning. The light illuminates in the hearts, and my longing for you grows. I let part of it for the people to be spoken about it, I determined to destroy the hands of those who defame the precious due to the way of communication of the fans and distracting the love. If we unfold the admirer's hearts and we unwrap it, it has destiny from it, apart from the desire of his observers, O oh beauty. Following this is your time to show the love with love, different from the ways of the arrogance with me. I am in the blooming relationship which everybody is aware, the aura of in love character, is from the written destiny. And I treasure you, the one who stole my heart from me, composing the desire in my heart for the announcement. And I am hurt by the distance and for the wound it has medicine. The medicine connects people as if the beautiful sayings. And I love you with a love which is not similar to any love. And I long for you with a longing which has no ending. Do not send your eyelashes to a passionately in love, lover surrender, and arise from the successful longing gossip by Faza. The dark clouds gathered before thunder. Oh, I wish, if only, the rain would deliberately rain down and touch carefully her palm. The most important thing is, I felt her in my veins, the memories of her flow steadily. They are like the fire that makes my heart beat. I hide grief and sadness, and I manage to hide them well. I ignore desires, even if they are present, and bitterness grows together with the longing. Others whisper to see the poison work its duty and prevent love from blossoming, and the gossips increase to the tune of lies. The arrogant seductresses fill in with their choir how to lower grievance, sadness of the world, on an absent random girl. I feel joy for. She came back, and I feel annoyance for the compulsion of holding her back. On the night of fire, the heat leaves her burning, and she covers up her grief. I am a man who is being strong, 
Breaking my tears into small pieces, I shy away from the comfort of a young gazelle who already took place in my heart and left traces on my cheeks as a witness over it. The Nature of the Soul by Faza. O people who love poetry, I will never leave poetry and my thinking is full with its rhyme. I built for me a big name between the famous people in the poetry square and also I created a great verses of poetry which illuminate the face of someone who is saying the poem and if you want to know the real meaning of a brave man you can see my father's name above the highest point of the mountain to shape it and glories are come to us and get humble for us and we magnify them and for those who understand that to be man you have to get a new idea or new verses I want him to know that our doings never be the same with another and me when I came back to Dubai uh, I found something wonderful which I was waiting for she is like the clear air uh, hi and big welcome to you uh, marhaba it's the way of welcoming in the Emirati dialect um, I wish I can get like the sand of Zayed's house for you uh, to be able to welcome you with the greatest way which you deserve. Zayed's house recommended me to save you inside my heart and I agreed to save you inside me and put you on the upper point of the most highest mountain of it. And for me, if you just come to me during my sorrow, I suddenly get happy and fresh. Congratulation to you from Zayed's house and congratulation to Zayed's house with you. And I wish Allah forgive you about your bad thinking about me. How dare you think that I forget you? I never ever forget you and don't tell me about anything. I never forget your cute scarf swaying in the air. How much the longing came to me and it caused wakefulness for all my nights to show me the absence of your smooth imagination. And your delicious longing captivated me. And in the darkness of the night, her feminine shadow came to and stay with me until the morning then I don't know anything about her. Anyone wants to know what I took from her, I took myself misery. And if you ask what I gave to her, I gave her all my life. And if you ask me why you want her this much, I will answer you with that nobody is like her in my ease. I get away from her and then I come back again as though my emotions never accept with anyone. And I just need her. She is more expensive than anything for me which I saw or I will see nothing like her. Her neck with the rest are the meaning of high cost from her magical beauty. I will always be for her. I will never see any girl other even if there are similar to her. I tried to change myself, but I can't. Myself still as it is. And if anyone gave me what I wanted, I will give a hand for it firstly.